Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how I make my turmeric scrub. First, I'm gonna start off by showing you everything that I'm gonna be using. I'm gonna be using sugar, sunflower oil, but you can use any oil of your choice, essential orange oil, organic turmeric, and honey. So let's get started. So now we're gonna add all of those ingredients into a bowl. First off, I'm adding sugar. Sugar is a great exfoliant. It really helps to buff away all the dead skin. Next, I'm gonna add the sunflower oil. Sunflower oil is great for nourishing and moisturizing the skin during the exfoliation process. Next, I'm gonna add the turmeric. Turmeric is an amazing antioxidant that helps to treat skin conditions like acne, dark marks, and sun damage. After the turmeric, I'm gonna add the honey. Now, honey does a really good job at balancing out the bacteria on the skin, and it also helps to speed up the skin's healing process. Lastly, I'm going to add the orange oil. The orange oil is a natural cleanser that helps to detoxify the skin. It's also loaded with vitamin C, so it helps to boost collagen, and it makes this scrub smell like fresh orange juice. Now that I have all of my ingredients in a bowl, I'm going to take my time and slowly mix everything together until it is nicely combined. A little backstory on this scrub, I've actually been using this scrub myself for the last eight months and I finally decided to make it available for purchase about two months ago. And I'm so happy to say that this is actually our number one selling product. Um, I use this scrub myself about two to three times a week. I love using it on my face about twice a week to help remove my makeup or to give my face a little pick me up if it's feeling a little dull after a work week. I also like to use it on my underarms before and after I shave. Um, also on my bikini area and my legs and I just love how it makes my skin glow and it feels so soft and really moisturized. So here I'm just mixing, mixing, mixing until I have everything nicely combined. I check the consistency like I'm doing now a lot of times when I'm making my scrub because I like it to be the perfect slushy consistency. I don't like scrubs that are too oily or scrubs that have too much sugar. So I like to make sure it's the perfect balance before I put everything in the jar. Now that everything is nicely combined, it is time to put everything in the jar. Y'all do not judge me for using this little spoon. Um, I have tried many different methods of filling these jars with this scrub and this is the way that works best for me. But anywho, this part of the video is pretty, pretty self-explanatory so I'm gonna shut up and let you guys watch.
all the jars have been filled, it is time to wipe off the tops and disinfect them so that we can add the labels. Now that all of the jars have been disinfected, it is time to add the labels. I know someone is going to ask and I make the labels myself in Canva. These are two by three labels on an eight ounce jar. Once I have created the labels in Canva, I then upload the image to Avery.com and Avery actually prints and ships all of my labels. But yeah, that is pretty much it. This is how I make my number one selling turmeric scrub. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below in the comment section. As always, thank you so much for watching. And stay tuned for the end of the video where I show you how to use the scrub. Bye guys. I know if you're myself, you're my east, you're my west When you see me at my worst, try to make me feel my best This love we just can't deny it You know all the ways I like it You holding me tangled up in these sheets Holding you, holding me easy love You holding me tangled up in these sheets holding you holding me easy love like a drive in the sun